Because I'm going to tell you, I worked offshore and made good money offshore, but be dealing with the racism I dealt with out there and everything, back then called a nigga, and everything I dealt with, man, it came at a price. Yep. Mm-hmm. So sometimes the big money come at a price when you're not in control. Yep. I feel like a bra strap just fell off. <laughs> 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 I, I had like a little bra strap. I like a bra strap just came <laughs> on my shit. Man, Rob, right, you're looking like Buck, buck <laughs> Week without the hat. <laughs> <laughs> like, 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 like a bra strap just popped <laughs> off. That's how it be. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, it, it seemed like, you know, when, when you deal with stuff at a price sometimes, and even if it's the less money you make, it's the peace when you control your own time. Mm-hmm. You know, yep. and that right there is irreplaceable because you can control your own time. Yep. And I've realized, man, I got offers to go back offshore. Hey, man, we're going to pay you 300000 a year, this, that, and the other. And that sounds great because I know, like, in my struggle sometimes, it's like I want to give up my freedom to go make the money. Because mm-hmm. in my mind, I think, well, if I just go do that for one year, then you know, I can come back and pay my debt off. Mm-hmm. But what happens is when you take that step and you get locked into that money, you start yeah, making more yeah, bills yeah. and you're not coming back. You're not coming mm-hmm. back. And then now you look at how much your children have grown and how much you've missed. So yeah. for me, what I've learned is that the reward is having control of your time, even if it's less money. Thanks. And then you learn how to survive with it. It's so crazy yeah. that with less money, mm-hmm. I'm able to have more mm-hmm. because I've realized that I don't need a lot of the extra stuff. What do I need five cars for? 